What do you think interviewer looks like while selecting candidates with zero experience? Yes, including 4 to 5 projects will make the interviewer feel your resume is worthy. So why late? Let's upgrade our resumes. I am going to share two very long projects which I have included in my CV and were a part of my interview discussion. I will also share the questions which were asked during my interview. To do very long projects, you can either install iVerilog on your system or you can use EDA Playground whose link is mentioned here. First project you can include is Risk Processor. It is included in NPTEL course Hardware Modeling Using Verilog by Professor Indranil Sen Gupta of IIT Karakpur. In the last five lectures, Professor explains the stages in Risk Processor and the code. You can compile and check for yourself using the softwares given above. This is the course for NPTEL lectures. In case you don't know where to start Verilog from, this course is taught from basics to the advanced level, so better start with this course. The questions asked in my interview about this project are how many stages are there and what are the stages? Can you please explain what each stage does? And he has also asked how this processor have improved the speed. You should be able to explain what each stage does and if possible, you should be able to write logic at least in pseudocode. It would leave a good impression on the interviewer. Including a well-prepared project is like writing an exam with known question paper. In case you include projects and cannot answer in the interview, interviewer will think you are bluffing and have no good skills. So better be well prepared about everything you write in your CV. Second very long project I have included is FIFO. First in first out implementation. This is the code link for implementing the project and this is the theory link. There are other versions to implement this project as well. You can search it on YouTube in case you want to try other versions. In my interview, they have asked me to write logic for full and empty condition. The interviewer can also ask you to write a small code snippet as well, so be prepared. The interviewer also asked me about the FIFO depth and width that I have implemented. This project is about synchronous FIFO. The interviewer asked me, in case you have to implement asynchronous FIFO, how do you do it? There was 5 minutes of discussion on this and later he said, it is a whole research topic so he moved on to the next question. A lot of students do a mistake of not learning the code even if they include programming projects in their CV. To stand out among other candidates, it is better to learn code snippet of the project. What do you want to know as a real estate treasure? Comment below.